The House Adoc Committee of the Recovery of 1.2 trillion unclaimed funds in uh, commercial banks, the CBN, as well as the MDAs, has alarmed Nigerians over the discovery of over 300 billion naira since the start of its investigation so far. Chairman of the committee, Honorable Moyeme Irem, discussed this after a session with officials of the Nigeria Investment Promotion Council. Emmanuel Hegene completes this report. They have set up the Adoc Committee following a resolution taken by the House Adoc Committee on January 26 this year on the need to investigate unclaimed funds amounting to 1.2 trillion naira in commercial banks, the CBN, as well as the MDAs. According to the chairman of the committee, Honorable Uyime Idem, funds trapped are in dormant bank accounts in domestic and foreign currencies, accounts without BVN, failed contracts, excess unremitted funds, and many more. He presented a list of accounts to the management team of Citibank holding 99 billion naira out of the 1.2 trillion naira under investigation. You are indebted to the federal government of Nigeria um, in terms of um, dollars. So if you aggregate this amount, um, naira and um, dollars is amounted to about 99 billion naira. Members of the committee asked the officials to explain the status of accounts belonging to ABS Limited, Global Offshore Limited, and Titan Energy Limited, which are holding funds in both Naira and dollars. Can you identify by your records and account number 0011530? And 14 domiciliary account US dollar ABS limited with 212 million 369 thousand and 26 naira and 26 dollars 49 dollars in a submission the executive director operations and technology of the bank Ngozi Omoke e, said seven accounts without BVN have been submitted to the committee in compliance to what it requested from the bank. And I saw that the schedule said corporate names, individual, individual and MDA. And I just separated it into three. It's consistently seven. The balances are the same. Nothing has changed. Please, I just want you to get that right. I'm not, I'm not here to force any, falsify anything. The commission, however, informed Citibank that it observed the documents submitted had more than seven accounts that needed to be scrutinized. It directed the bank officials to reconcile their accounts and make further clarifications at the next appearance. The Director of Finance, Nigeria Investment Promotion Council, James Aqua, pleaded for more time to reconcile its account when accused of allegedly owing the federal government to the tune of 5.2 billion naira in unremitted revenue, operating surplus and other funds from 2015 to 2021. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.